stay connected to the Northwest and the world with FM News 101 KXL. Good evening. It's 11.03. It is 50 degrees. I'm Justin McDonald. Drivers traveling in and out of downtown Portland tomorrow might have to take a detour. KXL's Jeremy Scott reports the Morrison Bridge will be closed. Crews with Multnomah County will be inspecting sign bridges, cleaning gutters, replacing stormwater filters, and repairing areas of the road deck and sidewalks. The closure on Sunday is scheduled from 7 a.m. until as late as 7 p.m. Nearly all of the ramps to and from Interstate 5 and I-84 will be blocked as well. Cars aren't the only impact. Bicyclists and pedestrians won't be able to cross until about 1 p.m. after the drawbridge is raised. TriMet's Line 15 bus will be detoured to the Hawthorne Bridge. About 50,000 vehicles cross the Morrison Bridge on a typical weekday. Jeremy Scott, FM News 101. B. Wells Fargo Bank at Southwest 182nd and Alexander and Aloha was robbed yesterday afternoon. A man walked into the branch just after 1 o'clock. Detectives have not said if they he, he had a weapon. They're still investigating. Police searched the area with a canine. You can see the picture of the suspect at KXL.com. Uh, and just a few moments ago, I got a word that something was happening at Good Samaritan Hospital. I don't have more details, though. A staff uh, memo that went out told the uh, to shelter in place, stay in place. I don't have any other details right now, but we'll keep investigating. It's 11.04. I'll come back. I'll check on traffic and weather on FM News 101. This year, it's the way to go. A message from ODOT. From the Mercedes-Benz of Wilsonville Traffic Center, the wet season is here. Do you have water in or around your home? Drainage Masters has been specializing in individualized drainage systems since 1996. They back up their work with the best warranties in the business. DrainageMasters.com, CCB 188883. Looks like right now US 30, about a mile west of the intersection with East Portland and I-205. A crash has Lombard, uh, Lombard excuse me, closed in both directions. I'm on top of this right now. Cully Boulevard to 60th Avenue. Uh, you are to use an alternate route. And according to KGW's Joe Ranieri, we're going to have wet conditions right on into early Sunday morning. I'm Justin McDonald. Check back several times throughout the day and stay connected with FM News 101 KXL.